Hey guys, welcome back to Six Sister Stuff. Today I'm making chicken noodle soup in the Instant Pot. So I'm Kristen, I am sister number two from SixSisterStuff.com and I love chicken noodle soup. It's one of my most favorite things to make. So over on Six Sister Stuff, I went and took our chicken noodle soup recipe and I converted it into an Instant Pot recipe. So I'm gonna put both links in the description. One for the normal recipe, one for the Instant Pot recipe. Now if you're new to this channel, welcome. Every Monday I'm sharing a new Instant Pot recipe with you, so make sure you subscribe and push that little bell so you can get all the notifications every time I post, especially if you're looking for Instant Pot recipes. All right you guys, let's head on to my kitchen and make this Instant Pot chicken noodle soup. Yep. That's how it works. Sarah! Hi! You say hi? She's, she's soaking wet. So I'm gonna start by adding two cans of canned chicken. Now you can use rotisserie chicken, you can also use just thawed chicken or frozen chicken. I'll tell you how to do that in just a second. So right now I'm just gonna add my two cans of already cooked chicken into the bottom of my pot. Next you're gonna add one pound of carrots. I just use the bag carrots, but you can use other carrots too. Now the recipe called for a can of corn, so I just cut up two ears of corn, and then also one half onion, and I'm just gonna dump that on top of the carrots. Next, I added six cups of chicken broth. So I had a carton, which is four cups, and then a can, which is two. If you feel like you need more chicken broth, you can go ahead and add one to two more cups of chicken broth. Then I'm going to add about a half a cup of green onions all chopped up. Now for the spices, I'm going to add about a half teaspoon of garlic powder and a little bit of salt and pepper just for taste. Now if you have pre-cooked chicken, you're going to add your egg noodles right now and everything's just going to cook together. So I added a whole bag. It was a lot of noodles. If you don't want that many noodles, I would probably do a half a bag or three-fourths of a bag. So right now I'm just mixing it a little bit before I put the lid on. The noodles don't have to be covered. Alright, so my lid is on. Make sure it's on sealing, not venting. And I'm gonna go to five minutes. Now here's the trick. If you want to cook thawed chicken that's not cooked yet, you're going to take, don't put your any vegetables in yet, and you're gonna go up to 20 minutes and just cook your chicken broth and your chicken. Then the last five minutes, you're gonna put everything else back in and cook the rest for five minutes. If your chicken is cooked, you're gonna cook it all just for five minutes at the same time. I did a quick release there, so I let all the steam out. Then once all the steam's out, you can open your lid and your chicken noodle soup is all done. I love that if you have pre-cooked chicken, it only takes five minutes to throw this recipe together. So I serve this recipe with a side salad and some breadsticks because usually that's what we eat with our chicken noodle soup and I'll put the recipes in the link below for you if you want to find out my side dishes. Alright you guys that's all I have for you today. Thank you so much for joining me on this Instant Pot Monday. I'll hope to see you later this week. See you later. Bye!